From the verse 28, continue from tomorrow, from yesterday. <clears throat> oh Sundari, beautiful girl, I did not desire that Shyam would not see your breasts when I placed these Kanchuli bodies on them. But, O oh Swamini, I wanted him to suddenly come to cover your jewel-like breasts that are dearer to him than his very life and to become your blouse himself by firmly embracing you. <coughs> o oh, Sundari, beautiful girl, I did not desire that Shyam would not see your breasts when I placed this Kanchuli bodice on them. <coughs> but, O oh, Swamini, I wanted him to suddenly come to cover your jewel-like breasts that are dearer to him than his very life and to become your blouse himself by firmly embracing you. Notes. The earrings are hung, and now Tulasi must put on Swamini's bodies. O oh, Swamini, I did not put this Shyama-colored bodies on you to cover your breasts. I put it on so that Shyam will suddenly come and cover your breasts himself, thereby serving as your real best fitting blouse. This expertise in service must be learned from the eternal maidservants. As Srila, Tam, Srila Narutam Das Thakur has taught, Rupe Gune Dagamagi Sada Hobo Anuragi Vasati Koribo Saki Maja I will lovingly serve, following in the footsteps of all the manjaris and understanding what are my duties simply on their mere indications. I will always be very attached to Radha Mohana's forms, qualities, and I will stay among the Sakis. These eternally perfect maidservants are also very eager to teach others. Although no one reveals his experience in bhajan, they have revealed their experiences by recording them in their books. Tulasi must serve Swamini while she suffers separation from her Priyatama. Simply on seeing the blackish blouse, Srimati becomes startled by remembrance of Krishna. But Tulasi consoles her by making her relish the Shyamras. 
the spiritual flavor of Krishna. O oh, Sundari, she says, a bluish kanchuli bodice would look splendid on a golden bosom, but I did not desire to cover these breasts. I just wanted to create a wonderful beauty at that time. Tulasi is not at all shy to call Swamini Sundari. Does a maid servant speak like that? This service is situated in sweetness. And by speaking in this way, Tulasi fills Swamini's mind with memories of her past sports with her Priyatam. During each service, which belongs to Madhura Rasa category, she gives Sundari the relish of Krishna Ras. Blessed is this maid servant. Blessed is her service. Also, during the stage of sadhana, there must be relish according to one's own rasa at the time of meditation. This relish according to one's relationship with Ishtadev awakens while identifying oneself with one's Swarupa. The, this relish according to one's relationship with Ishtadev awakens while identifying oneself with his Swarupa. Means when oneself identifies his Swarupa, he identifies the real Swarupa of Radha and Krishna. Because the sarup of the spiritual body form makes to see the every place to the Ishtadev, in every place his sarup. Then that time he is not murti, he is not like a statue, he is not like a wooden or stone statue. Because my material body consciousness is so high that I, I see my statue and his statue. When my sarup awake, then I not see like this. I see my sarup and his sarup. I am a statue, so I see the statue. I am murth, 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 murth means I am Useless, murt. So I see your murt, murti. Statue form. But because my sarupa is not awake, my spiritual identity is not awake, so I am not looking you that you are uh, uh, standing only. I see every place to you. Because my sarup can see your sarup. Read again this. (coughs) 
also during the stage of sadhana. Sadhana, the stage of sadhana. And then siddhi sthiti not. Sadhana sthiti. In the material body when you are there. What to do to reach to the saru? During the stage of sadhana, there must be relish according to one's own rasa. Own rasa. First, what we have to fix? My rasa. Which mellow I want to leave? Samanda. What is rasa? My relation is rasa. If I have no relation, no rasa can come. Formal relation and real relation, soul-to-soul relation give rasa. Soul-to-super-soul relation give rasa. Rasa come when I really, in my spiritual form, in my spiritual identity, I develop relation. Even to the soul-to-soul relation give rasa. Material body to material body relation not give rasa. That makes tiredness, suffering, but soul-to-soul relation give rasa. What about soul-to-super-soul relation? And when only soul to soul relation is giving rasa, what the soul has is form, identification, your form, and his form will not give rasa. Your form means the soul is the center of my body, and he is the center of all inverse, which will not give rasa. is the highest rasa. And this rasa is coming from Radhika, rasa sar. Kundeshwari give rasa. One of the Radhika name is Kundeshwari. Means is a reservoir of rasa. It's rasa fall, flow from every place. Love means Radhika. Some is a one drop, some is a flow, but rasa is there. And it's all based on sambandha, relationship. Go on. Repeat line. So, so this, then there, there is no relationship possible in material. So Physically not, not possible. possible. This dead body, without soul there is nothing. Nothing. And we relation make this. Yeah. Sense relations is only body relations. Yeah, yeah. Is only to satisfy some senses we develop relation. Is no relation. Is formal. But real relation is not happen. Atmat relation, Atmiya relation is the relation. When the soul accepts the soul and they start exchanging that love, that is the relation in material world, you can see. There is much illusion there inside. Covering, this is the condition, covering with condition. We are one one condition, other condition, and they want to make a relation. What relation will happen when condition will not go out? We are conditional relationship. And relation means unconditional.
condition con, with condition relation what is meaning of relation is not purity because i am condition and i am making relation with one condition so but i know see the soul i am seeing the condition and my condition and when the condition is not fulfilled no relation this stops when we have this uh, condition not fulfilled when we realize we are so then this stops no stop it grows then relation means that is love from the soul when we do something is a love if we do something with condition is not not real love conditional conditional relation is there because of the conditional fulfillment is there so relation is going on where the condition is not fulfilled over contract huh? contract business contract my condition i become satisfied with this condition i change other condition this is going on but what atmi hai atm bad means from the heart to heart and eternal that yeah so do this sometimes i i think about eternity when i have a uh some seva for eternal and when i think on eternal i cannot imagine what is eternal then i think is it always uh fresh and and uh, make happy and this because eternal it is a big uh, meaning huh? means eternity you say one thing very nice seva seva make you to relate to realize the real position of you you don't know the the soul only you think on seva that bring you for reality in the sadhak deha only seva is the one thing that you can by service it creates love and love unconditional because service is no condition there by service love is coming love comes by service when you are doing many thing and when you see that i am serving in the kitchen of radha rani then your purity come to you and that give you survival and to give the work to you that one word you accept my that is helping you to do all the services because you think that this is all kitchen of radha rani that is the mood of the service for you give energy to you in the mood of the service when you move in sadhak deha it develop relation develop feelings this create really honesty of the reality for honest way of way easy way to go and we by working we feel satisfaction in that so service is the way in sadhak deha to go to the siddha deha service in the sadhak deha and unconditional because i am so conditional i have to do something unconditional to remove my conditions 
the, who can do? I have to work for myself, you have to work for yourself. Why is spiritual life, they say, very difficult thing? This lo conjugal, loving affairs, raga bhakti is difficult because you have to do yourself. And badi bhakti, you don't need to do anything. Only listen, listen, I know, follow, follow, again I will do. I will, I will keep, keep MBA, fighting everything I can do. Nobody will stop me. But in Raga Bhakti, you have to increase yourself. If you not check every moment to you, you don't, cannot develop Raga Bhakti. That is, we say it's too high and very difficult because here no escaping. Here nothing to show to anyone. Nobody, if you show your Raga Bhakti will finish. Is it your personal business? Is a personal effort? Any qualification is disturbing here, and no qualification is helping here. It's a different way. If you are qualified for something, it makes you ego. And here, no qualification is required because you want to be in loving. You don't want to be live in ego. Very different way of this. Process is different. And nobody recognizes that is our luck, good luck. By some time, by mistake, they write in book, so we read and know. Because nobody wants to give realization of how he realized by himself by doing this. They relish and they don't want to share with others. There is no envy. No envy. Why to envy? No, no, no. Again this life, you see? Also, during the stage of sadhana, there must be relish according to one's own rasa. Rasa means your relation is rasa, your service is rasa. Conjugal lover has a different service and mother and daughter has a different service. And the friend and friend has different service. Is a rasa is different. As per the relation, why Prabhupada write in introduction of Bhagavad Gita, this is very elevated subject. Relation is most important in bhakti. If not, then you will become karmi, Jnani, Yogi, he says how many Karmi, Jnani, Yogi and Bhakta? You see in Bhagavad Gita, means Karmi, Jnani, Yogi is or not Bhakta. Bhakta is or different than Karmi, Jnani, Yogi. Right? He has to write that karmi, jnani, yogi also is the bhakta. They are transcendentalist. Are? What is transcendentalist? He is very kind. His spiritual life is also transcendentalist. Why he writes so respectfully to them? Transcendentalist means they are practicing transcendental, spiritual thing, but in 
personal, impersonal. No relation. They have never relation. So they are very higher than bhaktas, but transcendentalist. Means, sorry to say, impersonal, not personal way. Right, they are transcendentalists because they are conscious of the soul, right? Yeah. Conscious about the soul and they say soul is the superson. So impersonal is. Means I have become God. Like you go in the European world and South America, they many say I am a Jesus. I become God now. This is transcendentalist. They are a transcendentalist, but they have no loving exchange like a Jesus with the Father. And this lover, Jesus, they want to make that they merge in Father. They become Father, once one, impersonal. You see? I see many. They say that now he become God. But his any story you say that he accept the God in the time of crucifixion he says, my father. Means that time he is recognizing himself like a son. Means impersonal or personal? When you see personal, then it's a loving. And when you see the impersonal, then he is a God. He has never relation with his father. She is doing because to become God. Get a good job. <laughs> and if he wants to become God, nobody is going to respect him, you know. Many God is moving now. Nobody respects. Respect is because his love is respectful. Why not everybody say God? He is talk about his father. Why they talk about Jesus? Why Jesus is so important? Because he is a lover. So he is important. He is in love with his father. So he is most important. His love was so important that he knows about God. And if I want to know to him, only I have to follow him to know this love. Right or not? So why manjiris are important? Because they know the way of love. So I have to follow, I have to follow the way of manjiris. That that way I will know the love. And why I have to follow not God, why Radha? Because Radha will teach me love for the Krishna. I say one thing more. Why you are here? Jesus sent you here. You know this? Because you have a desire of love. In an, any corner, Jesus said, My follower cannot teach you. So I send you to Prabhupada. First he will give you the Old Testament, and then he will bring to New Testament. By his mercy you will reach. But without Old Testament you will never understand the God. So you have to keep this Old Testament to come into the New Testament in loving exchange. You need some little time for that.
when your mind will become pure and a behavior will become pure then you will go in the new testament love what he bring and why he sent only for the love that i want to see around so during the stage of sadhana there must be relish according to one's own rasa at the time of meditation yeah so sadhana you see the life of the jesus he do the sadhana to relish the mellow of his love is to the in his meditation he never deviate from that if you not understand jesus how you will understand this sanskrit will not teach you because it is a foreign totally foreign for me for you also you have to understand that that tattva from sanskrit how easy to understand if i will not do in my sadhan side time material body consciousness sadhana behavior i cannot enter i have to learn this behavior in material body to practice in a spiritual body and i am fed in material body how i will practice in a spiritual body repeat again during the stage of sadhana there also must be relish according to one's own rasa you see according to your rasa what rasa you want you have to practice that is sadhana what is sadhana this is sadhana if you want to be a motherly love you have to act like a mother all your child because you see the your sister there everyone is a baby in the baby form coming to you that to sadhana i see baby who see the gopal amitabh mother he left body he is every place he see the baby and gopal is drinking milk from his hand you see him ask from siddha he biting in the fruits so this is the sadhana we have sadhana go on this radish according to one's relationship with ishta dev yeah the bhuj the center is to the center so this relish awakens why did you say you are all are my friend all your brother and sister because he was fixed in his to them so he see all the family any rasik any vaishnava any lovers is rasik and they cannot see without their ishta dev the goal should be fixed first what we do we don't fix the goal and we fixed with guru dev are guru dev is not a goal guru is the way like a navigator navigator he can navigate you only for the goal 
But if you have no goal, and when Guru will left the body, you will search again new Guru. Left the body again, search new Guru. Because you know, take shelter like a navigator. Are he never left body. Radhe, Radhe. Yeah. Radhe. Yeah. Better, better. He never left the body. Asan. He never left the body. Who said that Guru left his body? Guru is the Chan man. He is Nityananda. Nityananda, who give in the life all time happiness. He is from all direction near to you. Every place he is a Chaitya Guru, he is living in your heart. Every time he is with you, and no moment empty, you are empty with him. All the time he is like a wire, kabale, living inside the uh, walls, but he is giving light. Any place you go, Switzerland or Kurushia, uh, 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 Vienna, he is, his cable, cable is inside there. He is giving light and you are doing on that way. He is always. From where light is coming, his light is coming to me. Who bring to me to Ishtadev, he bring to me to Ishtadev. If he no mercy give to me, I know I'm going to understand. Only I am thinking about the murti and oh, just the altar and formalities are going on. It's not going to come in my heart and I cannot see him every place. If Jesus is not looking, his father, how he look the, everyone like a brother and sister? Which type of brother and sister they are? Because his father is every place he look and he see the sons of father. Brothers and sisters, all my family. Why to be angry with others? Understand? No? After so much love giving, and they go, Buddhism. Why? Where there is no soul exist, and there is no God exist. They want to become Buddhist. Why? Because this is more higher, because soul is not existing, God is not existing. And here, Jesus is telling there is soul existing like a son, and father is existing like a father, like a father, super soul. And we want to forget that to go to not believing in the soul and super soul. It's not craziness. Because we are empty. My emptiness is giving suffering to me. Radhe Radhe. Achhi ho? Aap at home. This relish according to one's relationship. With On relationship. If you believe in the relation, then it will work. 
संबंध नहीं है तो कुछ नहीं है संबंध से ही प्रेम होता है और प्रेम से ही भगवान मिलते हैं क्या क्या पैसा क्या सेवा चाहिए बता दस यू हैव ए टेन ट्वेंटी रुपीज गिफ्ट टू टेन जाओ लो लो अरे लो जो मिल रहा है अरे नहीं वो सब चलो अभी इकट्ठा हो रहा है तंग मत करो हाँ बैठ जाओ दे दो जाओ जाओ रखो चलो भैया राधे राधे चलो This relish according to one's relationship with Ishtadev away if there is no Ishtadev relation never relishment will come in your life you believe my word you have a guru everything but if you are not Ishtadev you will never relish where you will relish with guru you will say go out sit there listen my word and follow that you are chanting or not you do the job then i will relish only you can relish with your istadev istadev is a place for relish because soul is coming from the super soul soul is coming from that way he cannot relish different place and krishna then why say radha only krishna no alladri shakti will give love to shri krishna love without love what you will understand him He is a supreme personality. You cannot see him. You will touch his finger, and you will say, "This is the God," like a blind man. And then, no love can show you. Your relishment will come by love to him. Then you will relish. When love will come to you, then you will relish. If not, then you will get the gather on the information. Relishment will not come. Information will come. Go on. This relish awakens while identifying oneself with his swarupa. Oneself and his swarupa will come. This is the way, my dear. Sorry to say. Identifying your sarup, what we identify my body sarup. But how this will work? All the habit, conditional habits are there. Nature of my senses is there. Nature of my mind is there. All this condition, I want to release that. how i can release unconditional with condition we have to be unconditional to go to unconditional and why this is the relishment is sharing the wife in the form of wife mother brother sisters 
to relish conditioned condition or you can try to develop unconditional to unconditional then you have a experience of that you have a practical room to try and do it unconditional here yeah. this is practical room that is easy to understand this why you go to the practical classes to make the subject easy i can understand that water has a two thing oxygen and hydrogen as to as so for means as to hydrogen is to and as oxygen is for as so for is to h2o h2o as to yeah as to h2 that is different as to o so one is oxygen and two is of hydrogen double is hydrogen and you can take the system what is the practical you have to do that practical to see that is really is water is giving hydrogen oxygen yes then you believe it this is realization if you don't do this realization in this material world how you will not be spiritual world how you will realize that type of realization will come non stop like a unbreakable thread how you will store that so many unbreakable thread when i start living in my swarup and connected with my ishta ishta is here also working and there also working so this sadhak deha is very good luck seva sadhak rupen hai rep rupen siddh rupen chhatrahi when chit siddh rupa will come to you then it become amrala inside and outside met all the material body and conditional things will become unconditional chhatrahi any condition and uh, condition cannot touch you a godya vaishnavas taking shelter of the lotus feet of shri guru will remain fruitless if this relationship with his ishta dev is not established my god fruitless this is today subject for the uh, radha das only one this line again repeat godya vaishnava staking shelter of the lotus feet of shri guru will remain fruitless if the relationship with ishta dev is not established yeah in yeah by god is a wonderful word really this is happening is a fruitless our gorya siddhant relation see the mercy of prabhu pad he introduction pray take the bhagavad gita when the pray start he bring to the relation only after pray i ask one 30 years old person i don't want to say name two three i say you are 30 years old practicing in iskon can you explain about this he said we always escape two three pages introduction i said why because i think to go in the subject 
So they always escape this. So when they escape this, the, the spiritual life escape from them. Thirty years after they are escaping, and their spiritual life is escaped from them. Only they don't listen, the, understand the words of Prabhupada. He is right in one line there. This subject is very elevated subject, you know? This is the elaborated subject. Elaborated means all the books where you will go to see, na? All the scripture, this will come to you. So every time this will come. Relation, 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 avideha, avideha. Abhideha and Pariyojan, Pariyojan, Pariyojan. <laughs> All the scripture based in three things. How you understand this? They are talking only on and on this subject. I by surprise when I see. Now I say you Jesus relation. And you see the Abhideha of Jesus? He lived in the soul as a son. He never want to be a super soul. Means he identify all the time son, Abhideha. And he become mad in that. That God the form as a son. Soul got the form as a son. And Pariyojan, only he has one madness of the service is to love. Prem is Pariyojan. I see like this too. Prem is the Pariyojan of Jesus, no other. Mad. He is a mad person. In my eyes I see Pagal. He never write any book, he never do anything, only madness. So mad, when we will they will come in our life to become something in madness in our life. When this day will come? All the scripture repeating the whole same words. What is the use to get the shelter of the Guru if you have no Istadev? You know fixed one. Still prostitution is going on. What is the nature of prostitute? Many. And Gurudev said, no, no prostitution, one. This is the difference between prostitute and, and the, what you say, chest lady, one. And one, why? To become chest lady on the, in your love, to become mad for you. To become crazy for you. I want to cry for you because many f I cannot cry for one I can cry. And this happened, then Guru Kripa. If not, then no Kripa. Then no kripa. I have a guru, but I know mercy come to me. Mercy is coming when my greed is there. If I have no greed, why mercy will come? If I don't ask for the mercy, why mercy will come to you? 
If I have no greed for that, mercy will not come. Go on. Manjari Bhava means to have your mind completely reflect the picture of Srimati's moods and feelings. Mood and feeling, more higher. East means one point. Now Manjari, if you want to be a more deep in a spiritual body, you want to be staying in your spiritual form, then you need Manjari Bha, means you have to live in the same mood. Not only mood, and the feeling also same. What is your mood, I have to follow that mood. And what is your feeling, I have to live in that feeling. Gurudev, Masi bring from many to one. That is Istadev. And that has to do in Sadat there. Not in Siddha there. This is the job of the Sadhak there. And to live in one mallow, that is the work of the Sadhak there. In relationship, this is the work of the Sadhak there. And the Manjiri's bhav feeling means. To have your mind completely reflect the picture of Srimati's moods and feelings. Yeah, mood and feeling. Your mood, Swami, and your feeling I want to be. That is Manjari. These are the checking inside me that was where I exist. How I will check myself, where the existence is standing. That way I can check. These are the... What you say? Ah, mommy. To check the temperature, how much is that? Which temperature we are living? Yeah. Huh? Low or high? Low or high? Yes, yeah. Hmm? Manjari Bhav means to have your mind completely reflect the picture of Srimati's moods and feelings. It is not easy to reflect Srimati's Bhava Chitra pictures of her feelings completely. She is the embodiment of the full Madanakya Mahabhava. And on top of that, she is completely mad with attraction to the form, qualities, and pastimes of Sri Krishna, who embodies the transcendental erotic Sharinga Ras. There is nothing in the spiritual world as pure as this Sharinga Rasa. You see, here is a Singar Rasa. In Vasal Rasa, Jesus was so mad. In Vasal Rasa. And now you imagine in Singar Rasa, what is the condition of the Swami? Huh? More one. And why he said, 
go to the singara sa some if you not get that something you will get it because i am sending you for the highest jara if singara sa not then basara sa you will get it but i am sending for you singara sa more man less than me this is the mercy of the guru who send more always high to us this is guru kripa guru means not to hold i am holding you i don't want to like, give you chance to learn more no go more learn guru gur chela chini means guru wants to be a only brown sugar but he like to see his children like a bright white sugar nice shining sugar this is the nature of the guru always guru wants that my disciples become more higher than that me then he is more happy you know jealous he become more happy oh wow no no is very good at me i'm lucky i'm fortunate that i can prepare some good souls for the service of the swamis service and krishna service and my gurudev will become proud of me that the pass if you want to make proud to your gurudev and to jesus you have to do it you have to believe is you have to see that is mercy you have to do it not for yourself for him you do not it is not easy to reflect shrimati's bhava chitra pictures of her feelings completely because she is the embodiment of the full madanakya mahabhav full madness full madness full ananda madanakya madan means mad like a mad elephant madana if you don't know where he is going what he do man is is man why i said jesus was a man man is was a why because of the love man madanakya the the radhika has a madanakya because the origin of love coming from her she become mad in love how i can give everything of me to my lover what is this what you say material 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 sin sin are sin 100 100 times i want to do sin to go to hell is planet but i want to make you please narad come that krishna is very painful he has a too much pain and he we need the dust of someone to make the medicine i say you cannot give your dust radhika i can also give dust are why not rukmini and all the queens give dust they don't want to go in hell he say oh come come take all my dust take dust all gopis run a uh, country take all dust rana say you know what is going to happen to you you will go to the hellish planet oh only hellish planet more than that something i want to go 100 times again and again to the hellish planet but i want to see my krishna happy i don't want to see any pain in krishna 
I am ready to do hundred times more to the hellish planet. What is the problem? But I don't want to see any pain to Krishna. This is the madness, Madhanak Mahabhav. They are mad to make happy to Krishna. And the Manjaris are mad to make happy to Radhika. Kando kando aise diya dinna. Kando kando. When is this time will come in my life? Huh? What is the name? Kwando, Kwando. When this time will come in my life, that we will also become mad for this. Radha. Hmm. She is the embodiment of the full Madanakya Mahabhava. And on top of that, she is completely mad with attraction to the form, qualities, and pastimes of Sri Krishna, yeah. who embodies the transcendental erotic Sringa Ras. There is nothing in the spiritual world as pure as this Sringa Ras or Shutsiras, Shutsiras. By associating with like-minded and more advanced saints, and by gaining... Like-minded and little advanced from me. Little advanced, like you for me. I fear all you are advanced for me. So my progress is coming up and up. Like-minded and little advanced. What is the advancement? That your desire is also there to listen. That is your advance. In your age, my desire was not there like you to listen. So I am low than you. You are more advanced than me. You are more lucky. Ah, now I seventy-five years old age understand. In your in your age I have no this desire. So who is more more elevated? You all are elevated. In my age, what will happen to you? More advanced and like minded. Always a shit like this. This is your all of mercy that I am also trying to advance myself. Unlike my dear, also like you. Rather. But you are the one who put our mind on Swamini's feet. This is joint effort. This is not alone work. We all are working jointly for this service. By associating with like-minded and more advanced saints and by gaining their grace, these feelings and flavors will gradually be experienced. But the heart must be prepared for this rasa samskara by giving up all material. Cheto darpanam marjanam. Why cheto darpanam marjanam? Why to marjan the chitta? Heart has to prepare. Nitya Siddha Krishna Prem Sadha Kabunai. Why Sadha Kabunai? 
There is no any scripture who write that how you will get the Krishna frame. Show me any books. Because there is no any way sadhana for that is mentioned. No mention. You have to research this, how to kiss Prem Sadhya. That has to research. She said one condition, Suddha Chit. First condition is Suddha Chitta. Same, same word you're listening, Chitta Vritti. Suddha Chitta means pure Chitta. And Chitta Vritti, the Chitta and the Chitta means the, your mind, your mana and the heart to be a together. Mind, mana and the heart, all the words take together in the agreement. Twelve chapter, thirteen, fourteen, Prabhupada is mentioning about the devotional practice. Close it. When mind and the intelligence make the agreement, manasiksha you will see. Read manasiksha. Mind want to jump and heart want to do peacefully. No clash is going on all the time. No chitta vritti is pure. It has to be in agreement. Mind has to be agree with the soul and mana. That is chitta vritti. Mano vritti. Who will do? No other is interested to do for me. Why they will do for me? I have to work on for this. Every individual has to work on for himself. And this is a spiritual life. Prabhupada making Bhagavad Gita to show this. What you practicing? I give the quotation. You remember the quotation or you practice in day-to-day -day life? One is only remembering the quotation but for teaching, not for practicing. And one is practicing, don't bother for teaching. Yeah, sorry, I, I say because to understand these points is all helpful what happening. Nothing is non-cooperative or not helpful. In spiritual life, what you do is all adding. Is never, you, is a, you are, you are keeping bank balance, increasing your bank balance. It never reduces.